for a long time, he's been mentioned with the baddest men on the planet. For a long time, though, the title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. So here he is making his way to the Octagon for another heavyweight title defense. This has been the baddest man on the planet now for several years, and he has taken on all comers more often than not, leaving them twitching on the canvas. Knockout power for days. The question is tonight, with a challenge like this, can he walk out the way he came in as the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world? event of the evening. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now! This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the world. It's fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 171 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA, presenting the challenger, Assassin. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of 29 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle. UFC Championship. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. Defended her title against Liz Carmouche. What a fantastic night. And it showed that night that women can headline shows and main event and bring the fans as well as anyone else in mixed martial arts. And he caught the kick. Effective punch there by Nermago Metal. Beautiful combination there. 
Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. Nice right hand. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instance. Throws the right hand there. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Straight punch lands. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Well, you start to really worry about the wrestling, and there's that left hand from Khabib. Underrated. I mean, it's a very underrated part of his game, his ability to stand and strike with anybody in the UFC. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Clinch now. Oh, wow, those leg kicks are already taking effect. Mago Medov gets tagged by that stiff jab. Defense not there for him thus far tonight. Always finds that button. Let's go. Push forward and use that low kick. Effective use of the jab there by Mago Medov. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. so hard every time you can see him drive his shin into his opponent. And that one certainly found the target. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Changes his stance. I mean, he's cut down the size with his beautiful leg kick. And they clinch once again. advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Oh, crisp boxing here. The right punch followed immediately up by a left. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Nurmagomedov. Oh, that's a nice strike there by Nurmagomedov. You're always thinking wrestling when you fight Habib, but you better be very weary of his stand-up. He's developing this skill every single day. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, now he stuns him beautifully with the left hand. The left hand is so accurate. He's so educated. He's so able to fight for both fighters there. Lands with the right hand. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all the strikes. That, 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 that horn strike. sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands, his opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent's staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round.
Ermako Medov gets caught with that punch. Still I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. It's such a fast leg kick. Nice straight punch. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick. What a kick by this young man. He does a great job of disguising that technique. And before you know it, boom, he lands. The right hand just misses. Nice kick landed there by Namago Medal. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Flips the punch nicely there. Magomedov gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combination, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. How good is that right hand? He has a commitment to kicking tonight and it shows. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Big off punch land. Now he gets back to range. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Magomedov's kick to the body is blocked. Oh, really using his reach advantage there as he lands the punch, DC. Straight right hand, no good. Oh, big punch land. How about that chin? Pretty good right hand. Nice leg kick land. Oh, beautiful combination of jabs there by Nurmago Medov. Set up that low kick. Missed with that attempt. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Oh, he got everything behind that kick. Nurmago Medov gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands on shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up there. I mean, when you can hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talk to your toughness. Well, he has got to be thrilled with this effort here tonight. There was a lot of pressure on him coming in. He has doled out a lot of damage, landed a lot of strikes, near flawless execution. Sometimes the hardest thing to do is what's expected. When you're expected to win, sometimes it's hard to live up to that expectation. He lived up to that expectation, and he exceeded it with such a great performance. Lands flush with that right hand. And they separate. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. All right, 20 seconds to go in the rounds. All right, lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Oh, massive knee up top. Wow, what a head kick. Oh! Look at him chopping the wood. Oh! How about those five minutes? All right, that is the end of the round.
down, and the cut on his lip has gotten really, really bad. And at this point, you at least have to ask the question as to whether or not it's affecting his breathing. I think if this cut gets any worse, the doctor's going to have no choice but to step in, protect the fighter, and stop the fight. All right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC, and what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body, he throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot take many more of those types of strikes. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Oh, beautiful counter on the uppercut after he blocked the strike coming his way. Nice job on the feet by Nermago Menon. Oh, nice land with the knee. You see the taller fighter having no issue getting the limb to the target. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Big head kick land. to block that powerful kick to the bottom. That's a really strong leg kick there by Nermago Medoff. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter of eight. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. I have a novel idea. Maybe the opponent should try to check one of his. He's got to try to check him, but he can't, John, because there's no wind-up. Yeah. There's no tell. And when he feels his opponent is getting a beat on his leg kicks, he'll just pop a jab up, get the hands up to block the face, blast the leg kick on the bottom. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that is so diverse yeah. and has such a great understanding of landing these leg kicks. Nice kick. Nice straight there, I guess that's... Oh. oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Big kick lands. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. There's no give on that leg. They kick. continue to exchange. Nice punch, Land. Just missed with the left there. If your opponent has you in the clinch, pulling down on your head, landing punch after punch, you have got to clear that collar tie, reach back inside, and try to find space. And they separate. Tagged by that straight punch. Nice land for the offense there. Trying to double up on that jab. Keep that pressure high now. Beautiful punch. Head kick partially blocked. Oh, big shot there, DC. And one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh, he might be out. Don't wait, don't wait. I oh. Misses with that punch. Well, Javier Mendez, Tony Johnson, all the guys at AKA, got to like what they're seeing out of Khabib Nurmagomedov striking here early, DC. Great punch landed with so much power. Checks the leg kick. Oh, 
And he landed the right hand there. You got to check these low leg kicks. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Twenty seconds to go. Just misses with the jab. Beautiful strike. Big power shot there. All right, so the kicks to the body, certainly the big storyline in that previous round. DC, take us through the replay. He did a fantastic job of finding his spots. He was sneaking that kick right up under the elbow and landing those nasty body kicks. He did a great job of recognizing a weakness in his opponent's game and really taking advantage of it. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kick. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, that's nice. This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He landed a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly legs. He's got to whip his hip into that kick. Well, he's... Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. So you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Oh, worked hard to get up again, but he looks like he's compromised. Ooh, what a punch. Nice straight right, Lance. Just out of range with that right hook. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Ooh, what a head kick. Well, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, which is truly mixing up the targets. Sight to behold. Nurmagomedov going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. Two minutes to go in the round. Wow! Wow! Oh my goodness, what a fight. Yeah, few things better in mixed martial arts than a finish by way of the elbow. It takes a lot of technique, a lot of repetitions in the gym, and you've got to have a lot of confidence in your skills to throw those elbows and try to maximize force over a short distance. Of course, when you land, it can be absolutely devastating, and in this case, it spelled the end of the night for his opponent. Now we 
go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliot has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 57 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Assassin. All right, so we've got a new UFC heavyweight champion and potentially a star is born tonight, DC. He is the type of guy that makes people want to tune in. He is the type of guy that you know excitement will happen when you watch him. And tonight he becomes a star in a massive...